Hi, my name is Hamish Van Leysen. I'm a 14-year-old social impact entrepreneur. I have developed apps to help the environment as well as apps to help people with autism grow. My apps have been used in 54 different countries. Hi, it's Hamish again. I'm at the beach at the Strand, which is near the Great Barrier Reef. And I want to talk to you on how my environmental apps raise awareness of what's happening to our oceans. People are throwing out their trash into the ocean, which is harming its ecosystem and killing the fish. I am trying to raise awareness, so we stop doing this terrible behavior. In terms of what I'm doing, I have created a VR game to help teach people how to cross the road in a safe environment. It is targeted at people on the autism spectrum, but anyone can play it. I have also made a mobile version of the game as well as an app that teaches kids who have autism how to deal with the problems that it causes. My work is important as it helps people practice crossing the road in a safe environment. Transportation is one of the leading causes of deaths in young adults uh, aged 15 to 29, including people on the spectrum. My game will also help caregivers have a break because they don't have to stress if the child knows when to cross the road. My game is disruptive because the market hasn't been explored using VR too much and I put a fun spin on, on this topic so that users are more engaged than a simple story or a simple demonstration of how to cross roads and use other modes of transportation. I also plan to expand into other areas to help people with autism learn new life and social skills and cover a wide range of platforms. I was able to pull off my idea with the help of mentors, grant funds and hard work. I also pitched my ideas to different startup conferences and was selected by the US government to go to the GES summits in Silicon Valley and Hyderabad. There, I met a lot of startups and learned new ideas, including meeting Facebook and Apple. Facebook also invited me to the F8 conference, where they talked about what they were doing lately and gave me some free Oculus Quest headsets. My mum, my personal experiences with autism, and research papers have helped me figure out what are some common struggles that people with autism face on a regular basis. This allowed me to effectively create my mobile and VR app to help as much as possible. I am also in contact with researchers at various universities like the team at Stanford Uni. The BBC, Today Extra and many more media stories have promoted what I'm doing, like when a local news station covered my story to go to Silicon Valley and helped me get my crowdfunding page noticed. Also, after the BBC interview in 2018, the Bank of America offered to help a local support group that teaches kids with autism how to code or run a social media account. They donated over 20 laptops and other equipment to help, which was really cool. A tip for anyone wanting to start a startup or expand their currently existing startup would be put yourself out there. Enter any grant funds that you can. Um, social media is your friend. Use it to the best of your ability. And who knows, you might be able to find someone who can help you. Uh, one of the things I like doing is going to the Strand. Uh, right now, there's some artwork going on. Some Um, at the moment, I'm just customizing my PAI um, avatar, just making him look more like me. Yeah. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to the library and make it make music. So you just got to speak a few lyrics and the PAI will sing. Yes, yeah, so I'll have access to my camera and we shall do uh, Happy Birthday Rock Edition. So now you just got to press and record and say the phrase that I want you to say, which is Happy Birthday to you. Happy birthday to you, and then it will start making the PAI. 
it's just gonna load, which may take like a minute or two, but you know, just making an avatar and putting it in the real world. So once it's done loading, it will theoretically, the camera should work and allow me to place my PAI anywhere within this camera's view. Yep, it's almost done now, 90%. There we go, tap to place your PAI and I'm gonna place it on the little whiteboard. So yeah, I can move him around, I can like rotate him with two fingers and I can like make him big or small. Make it like decently large, rotate the face of the camera and yeah, and then we can make him dance as well. So yeah. yeah. So then we can make it like, I'm gonna turn that on this. Um, we can make it like dance in different ways. Um, you know, happy, excited, and it will play the song once we, you know, select the song. I'm gonna pick excited. And now, um, we can press and hold to record it, and it will film, you know, the little PAI dancing. There we go, so it's now recording. And we just watch the PAI rock out. Yeah, that's it. This is exciting. The youngest participant here is 11 years old. Uh... And most recently, this 11-year-old Hamish stole the show at President Obama's Global Entrepreneurship Summit in June in Silicon Valley. The president said, wow, the future is bright. And it's bright because we have kids like Hamish Finlayson. Our future is in good hands with the next generation.